Well, good morning and good afternoon, sisters and brothers. Um, I want to do this quick video real quick. Um, last night, I know that like lately, probably some of you guys have been feeling real tired and lazy, um, yawning all the time. All of a sudden, just a spirit of laziness been coming up upon you guys because I know it also have been done with me too. So last night, and I was like, it's the you know Satan just didn't want me to pray and just be lazy and want to go to sleep. And um, have my time with the Lord. But um, it was hard for me to do. But I, I pushed it through. And I had the Lord ask me. Ask the Lord to help me. So last night he gave me Proverbs um, 6. And it went from 4 to 11. And it says. Give no sleep to your eyes. Nor slumber to your eyelids. Deliver yourself like a gazel. From the hands of the hunter. And like a bird from the hands of the fowler. Go to, go to the ant, you sluggard. Consider her her ways to be wise, which having no caption, I mean no captain, overseer or ruler, providing provides herself supplies into the summer, and gather her food into the harvest. How long would you slumber, O sluggard? When will you rise from your sleep? And a sleep and a little slumber, a little folding. Of the hands to sleep so shall her poverty come on you like a prowler and your knees like an armed man so this is i'm reading this i guess is the new king james version so the lord was telling me and i woke up this morning and then i had posted last night so i woke up this morning and then again he was talking about laziness so he was telling me to tell his people to the, um, the spirit of laziness is upon people because Satan wants you to be asleep. Don't you want you to have communication with the Lord? And we got to press forward to that because we got to remember all things are possible through Christ Jesus who strengthened us. So we know that God give us strength, give us that he give us his strength to push through. And no weapon uh, formed against us shall prosper and that we're more than a conqueror through Christ Jesus who strengthened us. So we have to push forward and rebuke the spirit. We rebuke and bind the spirit of laziness. On God's people. We rebuke it and bind it and to the pits of hell in the mighty name of Jesus. For the devil is a lie. We will move forward. We will press in the Lord. We will go forward in the Lord and ask the Lord to give us his strength. And like we said, we have to just keep pushing and just keep pushing and pushing. And knowing that this, this laziness, the spirit of laziness is not for us. So you guys don't feel discouraged or feel bad. And uh, I know they feel drained. We feel lazy. We feel like we're not prospering, like, you know, going to the next level or doing what we need to do in the Lord. But this is the hour that we have to keep pressing forward because that's what the enemy wants us to do. For you guys, we have to wake up. Don't slumber or sleep. And um, don't don't be lazy in doing God's work. Also, like, excuse me, helping God's people, doing what he tells us to do. Because Satan, he throws us off and don't want us to be lazy and we'll, like, forget about what we need to do or, or, or we ain't doing it right now and, it's like this because we got to understand obedience is better than sacrifice. And so we have to, um, as being followers of Jesus Christ, we have to be obedient to his word. And this is time for us to go push forward and give the word of the Lord out and, you know, to deliver people. Because it said, deliver yourself like a gazel from the hands of the hunter. And you know the hunter is Satan. So we got to keep pressing forward, guys. I will lift you guys up in prayer. Also lift me up in prayer. And we're going to keep pushing, guys. Keep on pushing. If it's just even a little word that you can say, a uh, scripture that you can keep on, you know, the sword of the the, uh, the sword of the spirit. So we got to keep pushing. When it comes to mind or it's come upon us, we got to speak life over ourselves and rebuke the devil and push him out the way. I always got to stay with the armor of God. So we always have to have that daily, guys. So I pray that this blesses someone knowing that you're not by yourself. And God is speaking about this spirit of laziness. And we will press forward in Jesus' name. Love you guys. You be blessed. Amen.